Senator Lizbeth Benequisto is running. She's launching her new campaign website. And that website is under scrutiny tonight, not for what's on it, but rather when it was created. Four in your corners, Warren Wright is standing by to explain tonight. Warren? Well, Lizbeth Benequisto started campaigning for her state Senate seat at the start of the new year, long before the political election cycle typically gets geared up and going. And that got people talking. The only problem, some say, the money she used was special interest money, money that can't be used in a run for Congress. Lizbeth Benequisto is running. She is. Surprised? I am not surprised. Anthony Farhat is the head of a political organization. Values are vital. That's vetting local congressional candidates. A typical politician. They started running this commercial two weeks ago, questioning Benequisto's actions. There was clearly something going on with the congressional positioning while she was using state funds. Running for Congress, pretending to run for re-election to the Florida Senate, spending half a million dollars with special interest money that would be illegal in a congressional race. So when did Benequisto decide to run for Congress? Was she using money from lobbyists to build name recognition for a state campaign? Lizbeth Benequisto. Here's what we do know. I went to the website GoDaddy.com, a website that lets you purchase domain names. You can see here, December 30th, 2013, someone purchased the website Lizbeth Benequisto for Congress. Then, just one week later, she blankets the airwaves with this commercial for state senate. In Florida, conservative values are getting... Her commercial ran from January 6th to February 2nd. I checked Fox 4 commercial logs, and she didn't book any more after that. The very next day, February 3rd, she has this congressional website up and running. Unfortunately, it seems that she's used those funds to build a congressional campaign, and that's what our group finds to be disingenuous and inappropriate. Benequisto's campaign manager only had this to say. Her entrance today follows a time of reflection with friends and family. People know that Lizbeth is the person they can trust in this race. Benequisto does not have to resign to run for Congress since it's a different legislative body. And if she loses the special election, she could still run for her current seat. State Senate, Warren Wright, Fox 4, in your corner.